What's up guys, welcome to a new video. This video is going to be a grocery haul, my summer cutting grocery haul. We need a lot of food at home, so I'm gonna take you through what I'm going to buy at Walmart in Pier here um, for my meals during the week and also some stuff for my family. But before we get into that, uh, we're gonna eat guads. Me and Avery are gonna eat at Guadalajara's um, because it's Cinco de Mayo. And I am looking forward to a fajita quesadilla. That's what I want. If I was 21, maybe I'd get a margarita. Call me Max Tuning. But I want a fajita quesadilla in the chips and salsa. Mmm. So first things first, I'll probably show you a picture. But we're getting guads, and then we'll go get the groceries. All right, guads is done. Now we're actually heading to Walmart to get the groceries. Yes. guys all right we're in Walmart now and I have a huge list I'll put it up on the screen now if I can get into one screenshot but first things first we need fruits and veggies so I'm gonna gather all those up and I'll show you them in the cart yeah. <laughs> it's great fruit for the health let's we'll get honey crisp Probably just a big bag of these. Great for lunches, right? Yes, perfect for lunch. Good tool on spinach every morning. You're pretty much, what's his name, Popeye? Yes, Popeye. Yeah, sweet potatoes, classic. They're honestly like my favorite carb source, I think. Arguably, I love having them with like my meat and veggies, so. And they yeah. feel healthy. Oh yeah, they feel great, yeah. taste great. Uh, all right, we got apples, red onions, spinach, carrots, like mini snacking peppers, grapefruit, sweet potatoes. So far, so good. We'll get a big old thing of original salsa. I like it chunky, not runny. Um, at me, chunky is way better. My family loves salsa too, so we're getting the big tub. You get some raspberries and strawberries. Berries are like super low calorie, great for snacking, like just in the fridge if you're hungry and need a snack. Great for cutting. All right, getting some low calorie ranch. This is honestly the best you can get. 10 calories per serving. Ranch and all your dressings are packed with fat and high calorie in case you didn't know. Okay, now I just got a ton of frozen veggies because it's easy to keep them, easy to warm up and eat them. Broccoli, stir fry. Um, honestly, green beans are some of my favorite, like the whole ones. And then we got a bunch of cauliflower rice, super low calorie, high volume for cutting. Cowardly. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> honestly, I think frozen berries, low calorie, a must for putting in smoothies and my oatmeal, on pancakes, everything. I'm bringing you some pickles because they're like super low calorie and it's like a great easy snack for me if I'm like hungry but I already hit my calories for the day, I'll go grab a pickle spear. Bash. Buffalo sauce. Zero calories. Delicious. Okay. This man is picky about his tuna. <laughs> Not sure what that's supposed to mean but... Some cans of tuna, super easy to throw on a sandwich for the summer if I'm ever in a rush and forget to make myself a lunch. Um, very high protein, pretty lean, low calorie. Tortillas going with the carb balance, lower calorie and less carbs. All right, Editor Grant just button in here quick. I'm sorry for seeming like angry or like in a rush in the video. I was trying to make the clips short, but I promise I was having a good time. It did take a while, but just so you know, I'm realizing now that I kind of looked angry or just like very abrupt about everything. So we'll improve upon it in the future grocery hauls. Getting some salsa sun chips. These are the best flavor. They slap. Uh, my sister wanted them more than me, but I'll probably have some. Right, we're gonna get some rice cakes. These are a cutting staple. It's like 50 calories per rice cake. They're pretty big, pretty filling. Um, definitely recommend trying them out if you're trying to lose some weight, cut the calories. Grant just fit his fat butt through this, so that's impressive. <laughs> Alright, we got fat free cheddar cheese shredded. It's 45 calories per serving. It looks pretty like 
weird, but I'm gonna try it and see if I actually like it. I've tried some other fat free, but this one might be the one that takes the cake. All right, I'm getting the big old crate of eggs because I go through a lot of eggs in my house and let alone my family has some too. So we're getting the 60 pack um, Biden bulk, baby. Um, also I'm salty because I told him we should get pasture-raised and he said no. <laughs> It's too expensive and he goes through too many eggs. So that's a sad day. I was trying to make him healthier at Vero. Please watch this video so you can see this. We have a full cart already, ladies and gents. It's gonna be a lot of money. Um, which flavor should I try? Chocolate, for sure. Wait, peanut butter maybe? I don't know. 160 calories. Is that worth it? <laughs> 160 for a cup. 150 for a cup, two more grams of protein. Mm. Heck yeah, brother. <laughs> All right, I saw these like this protein cereal in some guy's YouTube video. They don't have the brand here. It's like 20 grams of protein per serving. Um, so we're gonna try these. It's like keto friendly, but 17 grams of protein per serving, 160 calories per cup, and it's peanut butter. So maybe it'll be like the peanut butter Captain Crunch. That would be delicious. I'm gonna try it later tonight or tomorrow. All right, we got a big bag of frozen chicken breasts just straight up all dollies out and cook these it's just nice to have these on hand for my meal prepping um, which i'm gonna do this week probably for my lunches and then we have the pre-made already cooked fajita chicken breast strips like grilled chicken already cooked it is really really convenient so uh, give this a try if you just want something that's easy and quick and lean all right i had to get a lunch box I had to get Words a are hard. I had to get a lunchbox and an ice pack because we're running at home with all of us here this summer and everybody working. We're taking our lunches and we don't have enough stuff. What the heck? All right, that is everything. This is all mine. I'm not sure how much this is gonna cost, but I will tell you after we check out. So I'll see you then. All right, what's up, guys? It's the next day now. I got a little sunburnt. I got home late last night, so I didn't really want to record all this, but. I'm gonna go through the whole price. The total was $178.24. And that was for a lot of food. I honestly thought it would be more. So I think this is kind of can show, at least in my opinion, um, eating healthy is not that expensive because that stuff's gonna last me a long time, everything I bought. And it was more than just for me. So it's not that expensive. You guys can definitely do it. But yeah, $178.24. And now we're going to try these Keto Wonderworks Keto Friendly Protein Cereal Peanut Butter Flavor. 17 grams of protein, 6 grams fat, 3 grams carbs, 1 gram sugar in one serving. And a serving is 40 grams, so let's see how much that is. Alright, so we got on grams here. So that's one serving. We're probably going to double it to make a whole bowl. There we go, 80 grams right there. All right, I got it served up here. I'm gonna put some unsweetened almond milk for it all over the top. It kind of reminds me like a more Reese's Puff kind of look and flavor. So I'll tilt you down so you can see it. But yeah, it kind of reminds me of Reese's Puffs. I've had cereal in forever. I used to have it every morning for my breakfast, like religiously. But let's give this a try. Honestly, it reminds me a lot of Reese's Puffs. Not quite as like powerful flavor wise, but definitely tastes good. It's kind of got a funny aftertaste, sort of. Yeah, I don't know. I'd say it's pretty good for 17 grams of protein per serving. I would say that's pretty good. Um, <clears throat> definitely a healthier version of cereal because it's lower calorie too than a lot of cereals out there. I mean, you can go try it yourself. They have chocolate and, I don't know, cinnamon was the other flavor. I'd say it's pretty good. Like, I might not go out of my way to get it again, just because I don't have cereal all that often. Like, I'd rather eat something else, maybe. Um, but, 
not a bad thing. Like I'll probably snack on it every now and then when I'm just in the house. So I'd say it's pretty good. Try it for, your, for yourself. Let me know if there's anything else you guys want me to try. Um, random new things. I'll probably do include them in videos randomly like this, but But yeah, that's everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of like vlog style video. I think this is what I'm going to do next video too. I kind of like it. I think it's more fun. So let me know if you guys like it too and want more of this style. Um, but that's the grocery haul for a lot of my summer while I'm cutting and working, making lunches for my family and myself in between us. So yeah, grocery haul. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day. I'll see you next week's video in that one. Goodbye. Grammar is hard sometimes. <laughs>